All right, let's start with the oldest stuff right now because we got a whole bunch of hot shit to speak on. What if episode five review what it do for you, B. Walt? Talk to me. Remind me. Zombies. <laughs> I, I just have to watch. It's going to come to you somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> you, you got it. See, you know, the shit, the shit happened in the middle of the week, so by the time we get back around, you know. It'd be a lot of whole other shit that didn't happen. Uh, so what they did was they took all the best elements of all the, the, the zombie shit that's out now and threw it into a what if and, uh, sprinkled in superheroes. The, right. shit, the shit was terrible. It was terrible in a good way, but it's like, man, could you imagine, bro, like, could you imagine Ant-Man being a fucking zombie? Yeah. Now like, I can. <laughs> the world is over. Like, the world is over. An 80-foot zombie just... <laughs> what, there's been five episodes. Ant-Man has been a beast in two of them. Like, unstoppable in two right. of them. Right. Like, that's why Pim was like, ain't nobody touching my shit from fucking S.H.I.E.L.D. Y'all can suck a dick. <laughs> I know how you assholes work. Fuck you, Stark. Fuck you. <laughs> um... T'Challa showed up with one leg. Bro. Uh, <laughs> he showed up with one leg. Like, the shit was already gone. Um, wh what did I say? I think I said it felt like a 30-minute version of Flashpoint Paradox. Like, niggas you know was just get, was showing up and, get, and getting dead, like, immediately. Like, lot, not a lot of stage time for a lot of, like, <laughs> major motherfucking players like motherfuckers was dying it was good though this was the one episode I felt wasn't as good as the previous one though like 4 4 was kind of epic in a way like just the psychology of it um, and how they flipped it with the Doctor Strange stuff and you know him battling like his better judgment versus his emotions I thought that was killer that way this one, I'm not a zombie guy. Though. I think you're more of a zombie guy than I am. So maybe you enjoyed it more. I, I am a zombie person. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, Walking Dead. Look, look, bro. Walking Dead. Uh, uh, World War Z. Wait, did I, I use the wrong pronouns? Because I said a guy. You, are you? Are you? You don't want me to call you a guy? You said person. As if no, I no, 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 no. He, hey, he, him, whatever. I, you know, I, I don't know how, I, I don't even know how they classify that stuff. Like, it, it, it confuses me, honestly. And I have to have my, I have to have my friends who are, you know, of other, you know, tell me, oh, I'm going to be known as the, because I don't know that shit off the bat. Like, I'm he, him, because I'm, you know. For sure. Just making it's, sure. I'm that, that nigga. So, you know, Walking Dead, uh, uh, zombie Nation, uh, World War Z, uh, the, the movies that came out of those, uh, uh, the ones with Homeboy, the ones with uh, Cillian Murphy, and 28 Days Later, all that shit. I oh, love yeah, that shit. Yeah. I love all of that shit. And I love, I love it when you get the zombies that are more than just the uh, in the background. You know, even though Walking Dead does that a lot, because Walking Dead is more about how people would treat each other in a shitty scenario. It, has, it, it really doesn't have much to do with zombies, right? Um, so That's the anyway, backdrop. Yeah, they're just the backdrop. But anyway, you see, you see elements of all that shit in in uh, in episode five. I liked it, but seriously, Tony showed up. He was already dead, bro. Like I don't think he like. Nigga, he like, showed up and was uh, like, "What the fuck." So, Bro, that's why I was like, oh, this is like Flashpoint Paradox. Oh, shit, this Deathstroke and Lex Luthor. Oh, shit, these niggas is dead now. What the fuck is going on? Like, they didn't care how many movies you had done, how many Infinity Stones you had saved, and, like, how many times you had taken New York back. Like, anybody could get it. <laughs> anybody can get it. Um... But it was definitely a good episode for sure. Vision's, Vision's twist was nuts. 
that 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 was a nice little wrinkle to me. Um, but again, and again, it wasn't that it like I'm just not that guy. But it was still a damn good episode for sure, for sure. Uh, yeah, it is in the middle of the week, so it's hard to like unless you watch it like two or three times. It's hard to really just like for it to sink in, you know, after the weekend and hit your other shows have hit and you know, you didn't have some libations and some substances and you know, whatever you guys do, whatever the five people that are watching do, you know what I'm saying? Um appreciate the fat five being with us right now. Shout out to C Webb. Uh you're a Hall of Famer. Um let's keep it pushing. <laughs> 